uh, we'll be switching over to that right now is the time. And we're going to jump right on board with that loser, none other than Showdown loser. And uh, we'll see Isn't if maybe... is that the funnest thing we've ever been able to say on the cast? Maybe he can be a Showdown winner. Well, he's got he's someone else there with him, so he's going to have to play carefully. He's almost ended up in the woods, but he will end up in the back of this good, building. Good use of the parachute. He's able to... Sometimes those are really those awkward moments when you try to do those last-second pull-aways is when you end up in spots that you don't want to be, where you don't get control, you kind of swing last second, you end up in the field, and somebody else lands at the building that you were trying to swing to, and things go really wrong for you. Uh, got control, ended up landing in his building, but again, we did see Joey Blackout land in the area, so we know that there could be a very early engagement there. Eric already pretty kitted up. He's already got a shotgun, the tan, got the ATV, the helmet. And he's gonna he's got an, uh And an AR, so he's doing fairly well so far. For this early in the game, to be that kitted is pretty good. He's probably trying to rotate out to some small campsites, etc., and try and get helmets and things from areas that aren't going to be quite as populated. Reptar, one of the guys you were talking about at the start, Absolutely. Pro League player, uh, nasty, nasty player. He's one of the guys that's got that jump shot just super down and on lock. Opening shots of the match, gonna be Tox as he takes some shots at Zhao Baby. Gonna get one hit in there before we get on board with him. Not gonna do much with it though, and he's gonna get out of there. Well, and this is that whole thing right now. There's there's a good fight to take and a bad fight, and you talk about jump shots, and Reptar is bouncing around like a Mexican jumping bean and goes crazy on that guy. He his jump shots are just so clean. There's there's a few guys out there that you'll see just nail them time and time and time again. There's a lot of people that use them. Mm -hmm. There's a lot of people that use them. There's very few people that can master them. Do them like that. Correct. Yeah, there's 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 a little bit of movement there to keep that mouse level right right where you want it on the vertical. Um, and he's somebody that's got that down, the timing of moving the mouse with the jump. we talking about that somewhere else? We were talking about it last yeah, week when we yeah. were watching him do it last yeah, week. Yeah, yeah, and yeah. we're still talking about it because he's just a really, really good player when it comes to that pie man coming in first overall in the qualification. He's going to get a very early elim with that shotgun. Positive patty. Just, it, just, be just, a positive positive, patty. just bringing the positivity. I just love that name. Be a positive patty, everybody. Well, race car is going to race his Better way out of there. Better than a negative Nancy. That I mean. See? That's the whole point. That's why it's a positive patty. It's not a negative Nancy. Is that what it is? Yeah. I, I would have never caught on. <laughs> you did catch on. You said it. Oh, man. You're Dude, so good. I'm just so good at this. So good. Everyone just, just pat Jason on the head next time you see him. He's so good. I'm a good boy. He's good. Blue wave going to be getting looted up here a little bit. Magnum looks like might have an AR on his back as well. Ribosom, Turtle, that one guy. That, I mean, there's so many names I'm used to seeing. I, we talk about it, we know the names in EU. We know some of the guys right. in the Australia region. We know one or two, three out of South America and yeah. APAC. Yep. But, NA but, is but like NA's, home, baby. NA's, NA's home. I still love all the other regions. Absolutely. I just, I, I love all you guys. I really do. I just. Every single person. My normal lobby everything. has these guys in, yeah. and I just I have normal interaction on a daily basis with them. Well, Reptar is hunting. Sees Clearo out in the open. Fires a few shots, but Clearo's able to get behind cover, but he's not going to allow him to keep that Jeep healthy. He's going to put a lot of damage out onto it, and Clearo, I think he knows about this. He's trying to go for it, and now Reptar has hopped up. He jumps into that oh. Jeep. Two immediate hits, and there's the headshot to take Clearo out. It Reptar's shot is just nasty. Yes. He's, I, I don't know. I'm just going to keep saying it. We're going to keep cutting him. He's going to shoot at something. Something's going to die. And we're going to I'm going to go, ooh, oof. Yeah. Mm. Man, Reptar's nasty. And then we're going to move to whatever the next fight is. And then we'll eventually come back. He'll do it again. And then I'm going to say that again. And I'm just going to make sure that I work that in every single time we see him. Well, Jess, three, firing a few shots over towards Black Wave. Gets behind a tree. Black Wave has this angle as well. Has a little bit of cover, but I don't like it as much as Jess3's cover at all. We'll put the smoke down. Jess3 looks like maybe going for a rotation, but it's actually like he's leaving. But that truck cannot be good in shape. And there's our first look at the safe zone. We are going to have an easterly, easterly time. We're going to be eastbound and down. An easterly time. Yeah. I, I was trying to come up with something, an easterly something. All right, well, this easterly zone is going to be a little bit off the map, going to be a little bit Aww. more condensed than what we're used to seeing in the center of the map. It's one of those ones that does make things a little rougher on the guys at the start. There is quite a few POIs in this opening one, though. We're going to have Lone Pine. We're going to have the Villas. We're going to have Bubba's. We're going to have um, some of those shops along the easterly road. 
I can't, I, I can't do it. I can't do it. The Easterly Road. The Easterly Road. Uh, but it's going to be a condensed zone. So we have 75 players up still. Going to be going into a condensed zone. Not as much cover as if, let's say, part of PV was in it with big res. But there's a lot. There's still a oh. lot of. Ooh, nice shot. Zao Baby going to take out Rucka with a headshot. Trying to really play the clean. Reptar game. Trying to do the jump shots, hitting him on when he hits the ground, though. It looks more like. That feels more like. Um, just good the movement, previous honestly. previous patch where before we were getting the jump shots, it feels like a little bit more that where you're doing your jumps, hitting the ground, then getting your shot off. Um, doesn't quite feel like somebody that's fully mastered what's going on currently. Well, we're on board with the COD rusher who has no rush to his COD. What do you mean? He is running forward at full speed. The amount of momentum is is he's an unstoppable force. Possibly until he comes across another player who does have a vehicle. And he's going to be pretty hosed. I mean, you never know. Maybe he's going to run into that guy, and he's just going to shot him right off. Very possible. Well, I am bad. Ha-ha-ha. <laughs> who's, 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 who's in the worst position? I am bad, LOL, or the showdown Carver. loser? Oh, that's a good point. I mean, I am bad's not saying he lost the shot there. He's just saying he's not very good. Yeah. He made it here. Mm, there we go. Well, Eric's going to leave the Cod Rusher alone again. Looking for those really smart fights. We're watching him do that. We're watching a lot of players do that right now. Finding a nice little campsite, a little bit of gear. He's going to heal up. He did take a little bit of damage. Just a little bit. Just a tiny, just, tiny just little a touch. Bit. Just a touch of damage there. Uh, now Reptar's looking for crazy. Ida, possibly. Reptar looking to take some more fights, and it looks like Ida's going to step out. Shotgun coming out from Reptar. Finds the first hit, finds the second. Ida going to get eliminated. Had an ATV sitting inside of that camper with him. Ida goes down in 74th. He is definitely aggravated at the moment. I expect him to come in with a little, a little, a little, a little, a little anger in his voice, a little grit in the next match. Well, Reptar was stuck there for a second. His cop car is too weak. He's going to have to take the ATV. A nice push by him, and that's him his third kill of this game. Third kill already is, is nuts. He's on pace. Considering we started with what? Right he's around, got fifty percent right of the kills right now. He's killed dog. Oh, he's killed half half of the half of the Elam so far. I mean he's doing okay. Yep. He's on pace if he maintains that. If he's doing like three out of every ten, you know, that's that's a that's a high kill. It's really interesting. You notice oh, Eric goes down. That's unfortunate. Well, uh you just noticed Flipper My Dipper was still in the gas. Yep. But he was the only one. Think about what we saw with South America and how many people spent time in the gas early. There was so many Very people different. Yeah, there was. I think it depends on where the circle is too. A lot of guys are going to rotate here early. Again, South America isn't a center safe zone meta. True. 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 North America, nice. EU are very much center center heavy. Australia, very much the same as well. They they tend to be a center heavy meta. Yeah, that is South I'm America is very loose. It, again, I mean, we called it the Wild West yesterday. That's really kind of what it is. This is going to my zone. Yeah, safe zone is pulling towards that area of the map. You like a little bit. It's going to be right there on the edge of Spence Hills, coming down into the villas. Some shots ringing out, coming down from above. It's going to be and it's that and shine. Rain and shine. Rain and shine. Oh, rain oh, that's shine. a good toss. Nice nade. Going to be a little, a little, little long. Taking some hits onto Blunt. Blunt did lose that armor. Has a new one on, though. He seems okay. Taking shot after shot, though, as he's oh. trying to get out of there. Rain and shine. Trying to put some damage in. Blunt going to be able to get out of there, though. He'll get inside. Get healed up. Waste two armors, though. Two armors gone. So, again, War of Attrition. Ooh, Ooh. shotgun coming out. Reptar oh. going to get taken out. He will not have that high Elim win this round, but he did put on a show to start this one off. Good luck to Reptar in the next one. Well, I mean, Reptar was playing a a, a no fricks given. We talked about fricks. So he, zero. he, he has had zero, zero fricks. fricks. He was just going for kills. And, well, that one bit him just a little bit. He lost the armor on the push-up, which allowed an easy chest pump. And he was out. Well, speaking of out, down will go Haza at the hands of Miller H1. Jesse on board with him for a moment here. He's just kind of patrolling around, doing the shark in the water maneuver, circling about, trying to find his prey. Smoke nade after smoke nade, though, is going to deny his vision. Player is going to come around, might get some shots off onto him, get oh, the, helmet. the helmet. Jesse going to get a new helmet on and keep on moving. Going to be able to get out of there. Emo QQ right on the edge. 
He's going to be driving by, though. Jesse will be just fine as he gets healed up. Now we have an airdrop landing here at Bubba's. A lot of players around, three guys around, but it's really kind of in an open area. I don't gonna be know if that's going to be worth trying to grab. We'll probably see that one go unlooted unless somebody can kind of get it on a gas rotation yep. where they're kind of by themselves and they're comfortable running in the gas this late. I guess we're not really that late. We're only a circle in. Yeah, we're, we're going into circle two. Circle two, we've seen about, I believe, eight or nine deaths so far. We still have 70 players in that circle, and they're already pretty much all there. They go so quickly. Now Emo's over here as well. I mean, everybody is in that area. He drives straight by. C9 Hayes did stop inside of Bubba's. I mean, there are so many players in that area around that drop. Four of them, and that's still a good chunk. Gas is coming off of that. Nobody nobody moving for it, though. I just, just I just, it's just not worth it. I mean, in a normal match, maybe you risk it here in the showdown not a chance especially not, not a this chance. early at 70 going out at 70 you're not going to really net any points and like swag turtles in a really bad spot he has nothing he can do and blue wave is actually holding was that a gold ar in his hand i think he has a gold ar so mm -hmm. blue wave has won something previously that or he found somebody early and got one off of him very true uh he has not picked up a kill so and that's what's in that airdrop. So that two-hit laminate, a little bit of ammo, a little more two magnum e ammo, two e-tips, which they're not they are not quite the e-tips they used to be. They're not quite the e-tips that they were a very short yeah, a very yeah. short time ago. And they're not quite the e-tips that we would have seen oh. back at the end of Z1. Bulldog Pulse, he's going to find himself an Elam with a run over on Dubisky. That's a, uh, not something we see all the time, but we've seen it happen a couple times here in the showdowns. Yeah, twice so far we've seen a full on Elam. And now Taco Truck's car is so weak, but Pulse has put himself it's, in I like a rough Taco spot. Trucks. And that guy has the name Super on the front. Super. Like a Super Taco Truck, I would be 100% all for Super Taco Truck. As Milk Gang goes down, is a super taco truck just bigger tacos or are they better tacos? Both. Bigger Why can't and we have both? Tacos? Yay! I yeah, I mean bigger, better tacos. That's you, I think we've had your business. Bree's going to get eliminated by Showdown Loser who's apparently winning at the moment. He's not going down. He doesn't seem to live by the standard expected of his name. Well, I mean, is it a loss if you don't take home an AR? Is that where the lose comes in? Does he get to 11th and just throw it? Quite possibly. It would be very weird if he won. I mean... <laughs> you can't argue that logic. I mean... Or... Yeah, no, I can't. You're right. Wow, Spirit's... Ooh, Spirit's going to go down to Toxic Gas. Not sure yeah, which not sure side he was coming from. I didn't been. see him on the map. I, I don't remember what side of the zone he was coming from. But that is going to be an unfortunate round numero one. Hmm. Very interesting on that one. Must have been a poor rotation by Spirits. Pretty dense po population here. Another. Miller H1 going to get taken out by the gas as well. It's pretty densely packed in here. All these guys trying to rotate out of their Evo. QQ going to run into our number one qualifier, Pie Man. It's going to take him down. Positive Patty. Going to go down to sick. September 20th going to get taken out, and so is Tankska. Just lost four players. And a quickness there. Positive Patty probably very still just excited to be here. I'm, I'm sure that Positive Patty is excited as we do see Blue Wave go down. Stone is able to find that. Elam and then Folds will go down at the hand of its TW. I think that this is a small little burst of bubble as we're seeing players come from that west side of the map, get stuck in the east side of the map it's like on the west side of the circle on the map and just they there was nothing they could do there you lied to me why snotty's on the map i don't just saying i saw this pre-game maybe they let him in no well i'm glad to see snotty snotty's on the map you're my boy snotty i'm rooting for him well as we are on board with novik here he has two IQ. Two IQ. Two IQ. Is yep. that short for two hundred IQ, or is that actually like he has two IQ plays? Uh, it looks like there's another two IQ in here, so I'm gonna hope that they both have two IQ plays, and if you put them together, there's four IQ. Or is it four hundred? 
Bum, 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 bum. They're so far ahead of us, they're double the IQ level. C9 Hayes, he's going to get eliminated. It goes down in 57th. 2 IQ is in the gas, so maybe it's just 2 IQ. Yeah, well, 2.5 damage per tick right now. Kenkin's Pulse found by bump. Pulse. He was in a bad spot, and he has suddenly just done well. Well, that's the way to do it. That is how you win them. You just <laughs> turn well. on and do well. That do is the well. basics of how you win anything. Do well. Look at the middle of this map right now, as it is going to be just taking a little bit. Ooh, Foxy going to go down to race car. It's going to be at the hands of a shotgun to the head. Flipper, my dipper, also going to get just taken down by gas. another two so IQ Hondo. player. Hondo, yep, and Axare going to get taken down here. We just hit top 50, make that 49 as Cod Rusher gets taken down by a shotgun of all things at the hands of J-Strong. Irony. Well, Racecar putting shots with that Magnum down towards Laburga, sees Jess 3. I'll try to put shots there, but right on the edge of this gas, this play can be very dangerous. They've got to move a little bit more inwards to get safe. I think perhaps Racecar is safe where he is. So this is a pretty good move, but he has players all over as now Robbie Novick will choke out on that gas. And man, once again, we talk about it. Biggest player, he's the gas. Dick Dyak gonna get taken Dick. out by River. It's gonna be a headshot from the AR there. Pie Man gonna get inside. Try and get some heels off. Looks like he took a little bit of a hit That's there. Here comes a throwable. He's gonna run right up the stairs, get away from J Straw, get the other bathroom. Works his way into the bedroom. He'll be able to watch the staircase from there. Jesse and Dish both going to go down. Dish, our winner from last week. He's going to need a big game two and three to make up for round one's performance here. Pulse, going to hop on board with him for a moment. Looks like he is running right alongside another player who's shadowing him in on an ATV. Venom's going to get taken out here by Super Taco Truck. TW, Salis, they're both going to go down as well. Yeah, and then the bubble is bursting as more players will go down. KLMXD, Black Wave does finally go down at the hands of One Man Genocide. And well, up here on top of this mountain, right at the pretty much easterly side of Spence Hills, there are tons of players and there is tons of action. Ooh. Couple quick shots coming in there. Not sure if that player got eliminated or not. Rain and Shine, though, they're going to get taken out. Sick. West USA, they're all going to go down. T, T just trying to heal through this Molotov. Oh. Going to be able to get the heal off, but it's ticking for four damage. Had three. Not going to be enough. Not in time. Gets taken out by the Molly. Pulse right here below. Raiden and Hoax. Super taco truck behind him. Pulse needs to figure a way out of this, and it looks like the way he's figuring to get out is to just take the ATV and and gun it. I, That's what I you do. I stuttered on myself there. That was good. <laughs> well, I love tripping on my words. Still over here at Spence, there's so much going on as Blunt is taking shots. Allen is up here as well, but Racecar pushed up onto Nilko, has him in half health. Has, I don't even know where that shot went. Oh, this is nuts. Where is this going? Racecar. I, I think we were seeing just the edge of the yeah. of the server, not the actual hit registration, like a single pellet. Oh, I don't think it. that was anything uh, wrong, yeah. but that was there, nuts. There was looking. there was a lot. There was a potato war going on there yes. for a second, and finally, when you, when you're in a potato war, what you do is is you you switch to the sprayable gun and you spray and you, and, pray and you and hope mouse God one listens. as hard yeah. as you possibly can. Exactly what he did. He ends up taking down that that uh, fight. Low Bob Shooter going to get himself an elim as we crack the top 30 down to 29. Allen going to be rolling down this hill. Blunt back up against the gas Ooh. is going to have to get out of there. Looks like he has an ATV. He should be able to go ahead and outrun that. I am bad, LOL. May not have the same uh, setup there. Looks like he is on foot. Raiden goes down to Jaystra inside the house. Jaystra has been holding down this house for a little while now. Picked himself up two elims in it. Nobody's been able to take it from him. Pie Man has been just kind of using him to keep himself safe, though. Hoaxed, Race Car, and Blun all going to get eliminated. Last two going down to Joey Blackout. That's going to be a double play for him. Look at this play from Chewbacca. He's going to hide inside that little shed, but Tox and that one guy are directly across builds from each other. I'm not sure if that one guy knows Tox is there. He may, but Tox certainly knows that that one guy is there. Now Allen pushes up onto Chewbacca. Chewbacca. Gets the easy kill, doesn't even take any damage. He will get behind as a Molotov comes out. He'll try to stay alive. His 100 is up top. 
You ever notice the casting? That one guy just makes it sound like we actually don't know don't the know name the of the name person, but yeah. it's actually the guy's name. Like every time I say it, it sounds really bad in my head, but I have to <laughs> say it because it's his name. <laughs> yes, and there's one man. Darn genocide. you, sir! Getting taken out by the man himself, Freak. As Pie Man finally Ooh. tries to come down the stairs, and well, Jester says, "Ah, uh -uh. you weren't supposed to be here in the first place, sir. This is my house." I am bad, LOL, still in this one, hanging on 21st, gonna eat an armor shot there. That's gonna be the hands of Style. As he does push forward, he has River right in front of him. River gonna get away on that ATV. He does break Ooh. an armor, two shots to the body, down to 55. Almost didn't get away there. And now this zone favoring Chewbacca, but still has a little bit of the villas in it. Look at how much open space Style has to work with. He's got a ton of open room to his left, and he's got one or two players to his right who are right on top of each other. River going to get taken out there real quick by Low Bob Shooter. We're into the top 20 now, but he's got a lot of room. I like the space. I would need to see oh. him to actually see where it's going. Ribazone going to get taken out by another shotgun from Jaystrad. Jaystrad's going off right now. That's going to be the fourth Elim on the shoddy for him this match. Well, some players still up, not doing a lot of work. You can see Tox. That one guy finally does go down. So this fool had Avix. No limbs there. I am bad as two. And now picks up his third onto Jaystra. He's going to get that one uh, super taco truck, though. I like the guy. He's doing work. I like tacos. I like trucks. I like super things. Uh, rooting for him. I like it. Joey Blackout going to get taken down by style. We're going to lose three more players. I am bad. Super taco truck. No. <laughs> Mange all going to get eliminated. We're down to 12. That nade will go off in front of Gizboy. He's going to throw Ooh. one back. He gets taken out. Now we're at our top 10 as both Tox and Gizboy are out. Stona doing work as Tokyo Ghoul will go out in 10th. Down to 9. You see this final circle. It's going to keep centering. It's going to end up. These guys, whoever wins this battle on the top 5 in the, in the top left corner of the screen right now, yep. whoever wins that is going to be set up really, really strong in this next zone because that wall is high enough that you can use it to do jump shots. That is 100% truth right there. And, well, speaking of high walls, Freak going to be peeking over. Sees little Bob Shooter trying to put a few shots down. Chewbacca's probably in the best spot at the moment because he can fall back to that back wall. He can, but he's got players that can come over like Arrow and do shots over the wall from his other side. And right now he's at a wall that he's forced to crouch on. So he, there's a high chance that he ends up in a pinch or a third party situation. Ah, uh, that's your favorite term. We My talked favorite about term, that. third party. It's so good. Well, I mean, the question is though, can he use those players? Ooh. See, there's the bullets. They're coming in from the side, from Arrow, from all those other people. Style will go down to low Bob Shooter. Now we're at eight. Down to eight. We got Freak here. He's going to throw out a gas named Arrow. Going to get taken out by the gas. A little help from Stona. Stona then with a double play. Going to catch 100. Chewbacca also going to go down at the hands of Pulse. You can see this fight still going down right here. Whoever wins that battle of the pool is going to be set up really, really strong for this next circle. I think the edge is just going to be in the map. It is. Those guys are still in there. Gonna, they're going to have to fight their way out of that or at least win this fight. Stone is in a good spot right now. I actually like Stone's spot. Yep. Doesn't have anybody to his right. Can win the fight over the wall and then come in. That's exactly what he's going to do. He's going to take down Pulse. Now he needs to find Low Bob Shooter. Co whoever comes inside the uh, inside the wall first is probably going to get eliminated. Stone is going to find another Elim onto No Jiku. No Jiku? No, no Jiku. Freak, though, still in this one, top three. I like the positioning for these two. However, Freak coming oh! in from the back is going to be able to get low Bob Shooter. That's going to give the position advantage to Stona. Can he find Freak? Freak versus Stona, round number one, NA, two-dimensional showdown. It's the 2D showdown. That's this what you guys are watching. This is way tough for and him. Freak is in a really rough oh. spot, but he's the one hitting the shots right now. Stona down to 65. Jumping up with the shoddy is Stona, trying to get Freak on some quick peeks. Both of them trading yeah. shot after shot. Freak going to win that one like the freak that he is from the open with the shotgun, hitting shot after shot. Every time he jumped up, Stona was getting dinged. Just a little bit here, a little bit more, a little bit more. Whittles him down, takes down the match from the disadvantage side.